Uh, this will be the cleaning and naming of Psalms 23, 4, and 5. And as soon as I pull up 23, turn the lights on and click that, I think we're ready. Okay, this is from a priest. Um, uh, Wivy is my shepherd, I shall not want, for I lay down in green pastures and besides quiet waters. He guides me with... He guides me with righteousness. He guides me for my righteousness. For my righteousness. For his name's sake. Your rod and staff teaches me, for you anointed my head with oil. This is why I said it's from a priest. This is the only people that were uh, oiled, uh, poured oil on, uh, well, the kings, a few of them only, a few. And that is um, what our creator man, uh, commanded for the priest before they entered into his courtyard to... Uh, do the offering and approach him for their forgiveness for his love kindness and love has guided me all the days of my life then I will live in heaven with wifey forever okay this is definitely a high priest. For his goodness and love will guide me all the day. Will guide me all the days of my life. But that's how I determined this was from a high priest, or at least a priest. And I'm thinking the one in charge, uh, the one that was for the kingdom. There's actually one for each tribe, um, and then there was one for the king to approach. And uh, just as the altars, there were six on each side, and then there was a very large one. That very large one is the one that this priest would offer for the king and for the people as a whole nation. Um, 23, 24. I haven't titled this one yet. The earth is wives and those who dwell in it, for he has founded it upon the seas and established its rivers. Who may ascend to the hill by YV, and may stand by his holy tent. Well, his tent really isn't a holy. Who can stand by his tent? Now, this would be maybe a priest, for they were sitting around the tent as the, the same way the tribes camped. That way they knew... Um, which priest to go and uh, make their offering or sacrifice an offering um, for their sin offering. And um, and this hill would have been at the time of hint. So this is from the time they moved in. And I made a quick location where Shiloh is. It's not where you see it put at on the maps because when Jer Joshua went in, they conquered um, uh, Jericho first. And when they came up the hill, up to from the valley or the Jordan River anyway, uh, they wouldn't have just wandered all the way up there. They had to clear off the land. So it does say the next story is that uh, Josh went south, so the camp, so the tent had to be set up and left someplace. And so I just made a, a random guess 
people from mine, but it is not where um, my location or their location is different. Who may ascend to the hill by YV, and who may stand by his tent? Who may ascend to this hill? Hill for YV. And that would have been where his tent was located. And who may stand by his tent? Those having a pure heart and who have not spread falsehoods. Those having a who may stand by his tents? The answer is those having a pure heart and who those having a pure, pure heart and who has or have who and who have not spread falsehoods those are lies who have not spread lies and has not vowed deceitfully will receive blessings from YV and have righteousness for his salvation. Okay, what is righteousness again? Those who obey our Creator are obeying our Creator and it counts as their righteousness. Okay? That is their righteousness that they obey our Creator. Like the generation that saw him, now we seek Jesus' face. So that's what they were told to do is wait for him. We lift up our heads at his gate, at his gates, for our King of glory is coming. Who is our King of Glory, YV? This is, needs to be read. For he will be strong and mighty. For YV, will, for with, uh, for, or with YV, or with YV, he will be mighty in battle. Okay. Now, from this, who may ascend to the hill for YV, and who may stand by his tent? Those who have pure heart, most must provide. Okay, now this is just generally speaking of righteous people. But it has words for Jesus, so um, righteous people will are waiting. Yeah. And that's the way I'm going to title that for right now. If I find a better one later. Okay. Now let's go to 25. This one seems to be just this long. I made a note that I did heavy editing. And uh, is and is this my own? Um, you'll have to go back. Uh, well, let me just show you. Um, when I went through here, 
Let's see, here's here's a lot of my editing. Uh, see these ones in uh, Fuchsia? They are not r compatible words, where if they were compatible, I just leave them blue and green. But this is the way I've been noting that these words were the word ways into words or paths or wants. So this is what I'm saying is by making where he will pluck my feet, lift my fleet, my feet, that's close likeness. Maybe that doesn't need to be that way. But when you see this and then see the words, uh, where am I adding? What am I adding? Uh, I'm not really adding much, but I know that when I was doing it, I was feeling it like it was uh, my uh, editing. Okay, here's one in the way for his life and the way I changed for his life. So that um, was a big change. Um, so what I'm going to do now, though, is because I, when I've seen this, to get ready, I'm going to say I'm okay with what's here, okay? Now I'll try to see if there needs to be any more editing. To you, YV, I lift up my head, my creator, you I trust, and in you, you I trust. Do not let me be ashamed. Do not let my enemies be exalted. Be exalted over me. Um, rule would be another word. So we're having a conversation by a king here. Um, Make me know your words and teach me your wants for me. Lead me in your truths that I that teach me. For you are my creator of my salvation. I do remember why be your compassion and love for me. Don't need all this extra on this one. Uh, do not remember. You will not remember, I would put you here, meaning our creator, you will not remember my sins because he's been offering, uh, went and made an offering and was approved as being forgiven. You will not remember my sins, nor my transgressions. But according to your love, you will remember me. You will remember me. I am a male who fears YV. He will instruct you. Um, I don't know if you can see this editing, so I better just blow it up a little bit and pull up. The male who fears YV, he will instruct him for his life. That he will live in prosperity and his descendants will inherit his land. Is there two spaces here? Yep. He makes known his promises, and my eyes are continually towards it. Okay, so these words here are here. Actually, is talking like he's talking to somebody else. Then it's come back to change to his. So I have this wrong. It would be, I am a male who fears YV. I want to put and, but I'm thinking that's not the right word. Or 
E. Constructed. me for my life that I live in prosperity. And my descendants will inherit my land. Now, He makes known his promises, and my eyes are continually towards my feet, for he will lift my feet out of their net, returns to me, and be gracious to me. The troubles in my heart are enlarged. Enlarged. He will, worse, he will. Okay, right here. He will bring me out of my distress. And no, by looking upon my afflictions and troubles, or trouble, troubles, troubles. Let my integrity and uprightness wait for him. Uprightness wait for him. Um, yes, I see this, but who wrote this? Who would write this? The best I can say is not a king. Um, is the commander. I'm looking, I'm thinking of people of authority. Um, a scribe would be able to write this for um, words by a scribe or commander or who but that's 25 i'm going to read it real quick one more time for you ivy i lift up my head for lift up my head my creator i trust do not let me be ashamed do not let my enemies be exalted okay well this it would not be over him. all of a sudden it's not a scribe it's more of a commander <laughs> lead me or teach me in your tr teach me your truth Teach me your truth instead of lead. Teach me your truths. Oh, that teach me. I guess I can't do that. Uh, your, or teach me your wants for me and lead me in your truths. And this would not be here because teach is over here. I see him that. Lead me in your truths. You are my creator of my salvation. 
I remember why the I will I always remember why the I always remember you for your compassion and love is for me. I would have to put, I always remember you because to you, wife, yeah, I lift up my head. Now we know who he's, he's, we know who he's talking to. I always remember you for your compassion and love. is for me. You will not remember my sins nor my transgressions. Okay, now here, um, yeah, it sounds like a commander now, um, more than, You will remember me. That would be for I am male who fears YV and he instructed me for life. See how they changed the text to uh, this, this part is to our creator. And then this part all of a sudden becomes like he's talking to you. I am a male who fears why thee, and he instructed me for my life, that I will live in prosperity and my descendants will inherit my life. He makes known my prowess, he makes known his promises and my eyes, he makes known to me, he made known He made known to me his promises, and his eyes are continually towards me, for he will lift my head out of their net, or lift my feet out of their net. Out of their net, their trap. He will lift my feet out of their trap. Net, your whole body's caught, so trap would be. Um, a foot being caught. Now a snare would be to grab it and and lift him up. But uh, for he turns to me and is gracious to me. He look he watches me. For he watches me and is gracious to me. Now he turns. He watches. Me and is gracious to me. He watches and is gracious to me. I like he watches me and is gracious to me. Troubles in my heart are in wires. He brings me. For he watches me and is gracious to me. With, with the troubles in my heart, when troubles in my heart are enlarged, when troubles in my heart are enlarged, He brings me out of my distress by looking upon my afflictions and troubles. Let my integrity and righteousness, 
versus wait for him. By looking upon my personal troubles, he lets he lets my integrity and approaches was wait for him. Boy, I think I could read these over dozens of times and correct them a little bit each time, but this is pretty good now, I think. Okay, I think that's real good, but I still can't get a sense if it's more than just a commander. But it's nice text, and I think that was the end. Let me, let me count here. One, two, three, yep, and then I'll start with 26 in a little bit.